According to the Wood County Dog Warden, her office has already handled over 100 cases of dogs biting humans. Jody Harding hopes a little education in the classroom will help children have a positive interaction with dogs they may not know. 13 Action News reporter J.D. Pooley has a story from Bowling Green tonight. Staff members here at the Wood County Dog Shelter are headed back to school. They will be teaching children how to safely interact with dogs that they might encounter while they're out in public. I'm just seeing all the dog bites coming in and a big percentage of those were kids getting bit. Wood County Dog Warden Jody Harding works closely with the Wood County Health Department. If somebody is treated for a dog bite, um, by law the health department has to report that to us. The kids run up to dogs and hug them and dogs don't like that. That's uh, personal space for dogs. That prompted Harding to start an educational outreach program with elementary aged children. As kids were taught, you don't talk to strangers. So it's the same thing with dogs. If you don't know that dog, you should not go up to that dog and pet that dog or hug that dog. Um, you always want to ask the owner if it's okay to pet the dog. If you do get permission to pet the dog, Harding says the best way to approach the animal is from the side. Close to the dog, you put your hand down and you turn to the side. Um, a lot of dogs will think if you're coming right at them, um, straightforward, that can be threatening to a dog. Harding says after approaching the dog from the side, you can pet the dog from underneath its chin. A lot of dogs don't, unfortunately, have been hit in the past, so you don't want to go over the head because some dogs will think they're going to get hit. Last year, Harding visited every elementary school in Wood County except for three. We don't want them to be scared. We just want them to know how to be safe around dogs so they don't have that opportunity to get bit and be afraid of dogs. In Bowling Green, J.D. Pooley, 13 Action News.